I come from generations of hard-working people, farmers, farmhands, and day laborers, from grandparents who lived through monarchy, World War I, the Weimar Republic, World War II, and democracy. My mother's parents didn't like Hitler because he was not a Christian. My father's parents admired him for restoring German pride. I come from a father who was drafted into Hitler's Wehrmacht at age 17, who lost his leg on the Russian front at 19. Then he felt he was no longer a real man. His screaming and phantom pains kept us up at night. I come from a mother ruled by fear and panic attacks, tortured by memories of sitting in crowded basements listening for the Royal Air Force to drop their deadly loads of bombs. I come from post-war Germany where men without limbs and invalids from World War II were common sight. A landscape littered with unexploded bombs and munitions, constant evacuations as bomb disposal units performed their dangerous job. I come from inheriting the guilt of my nation about the Holocaust bearing the shame of belonging to a people who caused 70 million deaths of innocent people by a war we started. The gruesome killing of Jewish people, gay people, disabled people, Jehovah's Witnesses, political opponents, and Roma in concentration camps. I come from a part of town where fathers worked in the mine or steel factory. They belted out marching songs when they got drunk, songs they sang as they invaded other countries. Our mothers were housewives who had no say, who didn't leave husbands who beat them. After all, they were the providers. I made the decision that I would not end up like my mother or my father. I would accept all people, regardless of their religion, nationality, or the color of their skin. I would fight injustice. I come from longing for world peace, with a real fear of World War III. A war fought with nuclear weapons that could blow up the entire world. I come from the belief that I needed to get out. That education was my ticket to a better, freer life. My path out of misery. I come from the belief that I would never get married. I would never let a man treat me like my father treated my mother. I come from doubting the existence of a God who allowed the Holocaust, slavery, and too many injustices in our world. And now, <laughs> I'm glad to make a difference in the lives of others. No longer depressed, but in love with life. Happy to be part of the Unitarian Universalist Church. <laughs> Grateful for 25 plus years of happy marriage. I treasure life with all its ups and downs. Yeah, that is where I am from.